Kung hindi mo nakikita kung anong gusto mong maging, ay talaga mahirapan ka. But the good news is, natural na mababayaran ka. Pwede ba natin i-avoid yung mga failures, pagkakamali sa buhay? The answer is... Videos that will make you wealthy and debt-free. May mga plano ko ba ba sa buhay na di natutupad imbis na maging matagumpay? Parati ka nalang bigo! Alam mo, napakahirap maging positibo kung parati ka nalang bigo. Kaya sa video na ito, pag-uusapan natin ano ang mindset na kailangan taglayin mo para ikaw ay magtagumpay sa iyong pangarap. Kung gusto mong malaman, you got to finish this video. Hi there, this is Shin Kitan, ang iyong pambansang wealth coach. Thank you very much for tuning in to this channel. I teach people on how to become wealthy and debt-free. So mga friendship, ang pag-uusapan pan po natin ang isang mindset na kailangan taglayin mo para ikaw ay magtagumpay. So let me start by stating this fact. Do you believe in this statement that you can never win in life with a defeated mindset? Dili ka magwawagi sa imong kinabuhi ko ang mindset mo ay talunan. Do you agree? Type agree in the comment section if you do agree. So kailangan po kay maintindihan po natin the success of any project, any business in your career, in your life depends on your way of thinking because your way of thinking will dictate your way of living. Wrong way of thinking, wrong way of living. Right way of thinking, right way of living. Garbage in, garbage out. What you sow is what you reap. So importante po yung inyong mindset because your mindset will dictate your attitude in life. So the question that I would like to ask is this, di ba? Pwede ba nating i-avoid yung mga failures, pagkakamali sa buhay? The answer is no. The next question that should be answered should be this. How to maintain a positive attitude despite of trials and challenges? Mga friendship, I want you to take out a piece of paper and a ball pen and I want you to take down some notes or lagay nyo ng cellphone nyo. So, i-record nyo to. Number one, visualize your success. Alam mo, importante po yung sinatawag nila ng vision. Eh. Vision is the ability to see the invisible even though it's not yet visible. So, tatanungin mo sa sarili mo, how do you see yourself 5 years, 10 years, 20 years, 40 years from now? Ano ba nakikita mo? Kung hindi mo nakikita kung anong gusto mong maging, ay talaga mahirapan ka. I can still remember when I was age 12, mga friendship. Nung dumaan nga kami sa matinding challenges, financial challenges sa buhay, I told myself that I want to become a millionaire before I reach the age of 35. That was my vision. That was my financial goal. So, ikaw, tatanungin kita, mga friendship, ano ba talaga ang iyong financial goal? sa buhay? Ano bang gusto mong makamit? Anong gusto mong maging pag ikaw ay ika nga ay umabot na sa certain na age? So, I want you to visualize your success. That's number one. And once you visualize your success, I want you to write it down. Sulat nyo. Number two, believe in your God-given talents and abilities. No, importante yan na maniwala ka because I do believe that God has given us the ability to produce wealth. It is God who gives us the ability to be able to fulfill the vision that God has given us. Because you know why? This is what I've realized. Eh. Kung naniniwala kayo, first, tanongin ko kayo, naniniwala ba kayo na binigyan tayo ni Lord ng angking talino para makamit ang ating pangarap? Kung kayo naniniwala, type yes in the comment section. If God gives you a vision, He will also give you the pro vision. Diba? Bibigyan ka rin ng pamamaraan kung paano natin matupad ang iyong pangarap, ang ating mga pangarap. Kaya nga importante na maniwala ka sa kanya at maniwala ka sa sarili mo. Dahil the reason why naniwala ka sa sarili mo, dahil binigay na nga sa iyo ang angking talino. At marami tayong angking talino. May mga iba. Ang talino ay pagiging magaganda at guwapo. <laughs> Yung mga iba naman sa akin, ang angking talino ko ay pagiging cute. <laughs> Hindi, may mga iba magaling magsulat, magluto, diba? magaling magbenta, magaling magnegosyo, magaling kumanta. Kung ano man ang iyong talino, gamitin mo yan para matupad mo ang pangarap mo. Pangatlo, ito yung very important na na-realize ko sa buhay ko. No? Pag ganito ang mindset mo talagang ikaw ay talagang yaman. Do what you love and love what you do. Find something that you love to do in your life so that you don't have to work for another day in your life. Grabe naman mga friendship. Like for example, me producing this video, thinking about ideas, sharing these ideas with you. Hindi po work po para sa akin. As a matter of fact, I can still remember when I started this YouTube channel around 10 years ago. Diba? Wala naman monetization. Hindi naman naman kikita. Diba? Hindi naman tungkol sa pera. Nagkaroon ng monetization lang yun noong 2019. During those times, imagine mo, for almost 7 years na ginagawa ko to, 
It's not because that I'm gonna generate any profit. It's because I love what I'm doing. And then I enjoy what I'm doing. Kaya nga, ang, ang ganda nito, if you found something that you love to do in your life, even if people do not pay you, you're still willing to do it for free. But the good news is, alam mo, the natural law in life, pag magaling ka sa isang bagay, natural na mababayaran ka. Agree ka ba? Naku! Napaka-exciting talaga, no? So, number four. O, oh, ito number four na tip ko po sa inyo. One mindset that can make you rich is understand that everyone makes mistakes. So, di ba, pag ginagawa mo na yung gusto mo sa buhay, lahat tayo nagkakamali. Lahat tayo ay eh, nagkakaroon ng tinatawag na setbacks. Lahat tayo nagkakaroon ng detour. Oh, ito lang mga friendship, ha? Remember this statement. Setbacks are set up for you to have a great comeback. Nak naman na talaga, no? Ang galing mag-English, eh. Kaya nga kung may mga pagkakamali kayo sa buhay, learn from it, no? Huwag kayo ma-discourage. Use that as a learning experience, as a motivation, and use it as a stepping stone to what you want to reach in life. Pero bago tayo magpatuloy, mga friendship, sana nandito pa kayo, ha? Kung nandito pa kayo at nanonood pa rin tong video na ito, type naman na, nandito pa kami. Okay, sinad sa maraming maraming salamat. Sabi niya, dahil sa iyo, unting yung na ako nakakapag-ipon at marunong na mag-invest. Maraming salamat sa tips. Si Miss Beast Gaming, everyday nanonood ako ng channel na ito. Legit ang mga turo mo, idol. Ay, maraming salamat. Si Tonyos TV Official, dito ako natuto mag-ipon. Okay, last but not the least, mga friendship, ito. Importante on how to maintain a positive attitude in life despite of trials and challenges. Nurture a positive attitude. Ang ibig sabihin nurture, pangalagaan mo, di ba? Diligan mo. Alam mo, mga friendship, no, negative things can happen. Kaya nga, pag tayo po ay eh, nagkamali, di ba? Or let's say, mga uncontrollable things, ang ganda ng araw mong biglang masira, learn from your mistake. Huwag kayong aayaw, huwag kayong bibigay. Kung kayo naman ay nasaktan, why don't you turn your scars into stars, turn your pain into gain, turn your tragedy into an opportunity. Grabe naman mga friendship. Pag hindi pa nagising ang inyong mga dugo-duguan sa episode na ito, hindi ko na alam. That is what most successful people do because they have a winning attitude. At bilang pangwakas, oo, kailangan mapakinggan nyo tong story ng isang uh, iniidolo po natin. Walang iba kundi yung uncle ko, kundi si Jack Ma. Ha? Huh? Uh, yes, uncle ko in my dreams. Oo. Si Jack Ma to, alam nyo ba kung gaano karami ang mga pagsubok at mga failures at rejection na kanyang nadaan? Let's watch this. I a lot of fail. I fail for funny things that I failed a key primary school test for two times, and I failed uh, three times for the middle school middle schools. You know, for three years I tried to fail in the universities, so I applied jobs for thirty times, got rejected. I went for a police. They said, "No, you're not good." I went to even the uh, KFC. When KFC came to China, come to my city, <laughs> 20, 24 people went for the job. Twenty-three people were accepted. I was the only one guy. <laughs> and we went for police. Five people, four of them accepted. I was the only guy that I rece received it. So to me, being turned down, rejected. Oh, by the way, I told you that I would I apply for Harvard for 10 times rejected. I know I'll be rejected. Yeah, sorry I just want to say that. Yeah, sorry now. Oh, grabe ka naman. Alam mo sa totoo lang ha, in fairness ha, nung narinig ko yung story na ito, sabi ko kung ako si Jack Ma, hindi eh, na ako ano, tambay na lang ako, tambay na lang ako. <laughs> But he never gave up. He has a winning attitude. So he created Alibaba from scratch and right now is one of the richest men in the world. With the right mindset, ladies and gentlemen. Kaya nga, alam mo, ang pagyaman ay nag-uumpisa kung paano ka mag-isip. Kahit anong rejections na experience mo, kung ikaw ay nasa real estate, nasa insurance, direct selling, network marketing, negosyo, kahit anong rejections, ang ano mo, ipagpatuloy mo lang yan. My friends, listen to me. Never give up. Maintain a positive attitude. You may be the next Jack Ma in the making. Kaya mga friendship, kung ikaw ay nakaka-experience ng negative mindset dahil sa nangyayari, no, I would like to share with you one book that can change the perspective of your life. Only 5 minutes a day for the next 30 days. Basahin nyo lang tong libro na ito. Anong libro na ito? It's called Always Chink positive. This book can literally change the way you think, change the way you behave, change the way you make your decision. It can change the destiny of your life. Journey with me as I help you change your mindset from pessimism to optimism. 
active missing. So if you're interested with this book to know more, all you need to do is just click the link below or on top or just type the word chink positive. Type the word called chink positive in the comment section and I will send you the link so that you can order. Maraming maraming salamat. Medyo napahaba ng konti tong video na ito pero nevertheless, I do believe this is a substantial content and then once you start changing your mindset, it can start changing your financial life. Tatandaan, ang pagyaman po ay napag-aaralan. This Shinkitan saying to every problem, there's always a solution. If you're not part of the solution, you're part of the problem. Always think positive. Bye! Okay. So, mga friendship, ha? ito po ang pag-uusap. Oh, ito yung number one tip ko po sa inyo. And learn it and use it no, to be able to reach that is what most people uh, ito lang uh, paki-edit that is what most people's Thank you for watching. If you want to suggest a topic or review that you would like me to discuss on the next video, please do comment below para mabasa po namin. Thank you very much and I'll see you on our next video.